Good morning. It's 12 minutes after 7. I did not want to get up this morning after the little bit later night last night. It's nice and cool out. My quilt was cozy. But, alas, we must walk. So I got up. We're all packed up. Um, there's not water for like 11 and a half. So we had to get it from this lake here. And it is like bath water warm. My hands, I usually don't like filter water in the morning because water is usually cold and that makes your hands really cold. This morning, putting my hands in the water were like warmer than the air, than the air temperature and filtering was like holding onto a heater. Which means I got warm water to drink later. I do have one liter of, of cold that I've had with me overnight. Um, I don't know, we don't really have a whole lot of plan today. I think we're 36 point something from town. Don't need to be in town till tomorrow afternoon. But I think we will do, I'm sure we'll do 25 or more. And then have a short day in the town tomorrow. Um, I think there's like one climb that's maybe 1,200 feet. Spread out a little bit for the most part. It's more just cruisy rollers. So, looking forward to ambling along. Check this out, we're starting to see some big mountains with snow on them. This is Sisters Mirror Lake. A little duck out there. And just up around this bend, I think we're gonna have lunch and get water. We stopped for lunch, probably a little early. Well, we've done, I don't know, 11.6 or so. Um, and I've not done much recording. Somebody asked me a couple days ago, to show the whole process of cooking. And there's really nothing to show. There is no process. I don't really know what to show. Um, here's the stove I use. Uh, I will, you fold it out, out, put it on a fuel can, heat up some water. And um, for lunch, I normally don't cook for lunch, but I have some ex an extra, my food situation is good. We get a lot going into town tomorrow. So I'm gonna, Break this ramen up and put it in a freezer bag. Not a regular bag, gotta be a freezer bag. Heat up some water, pour the water in here, wait a few minutes and eat. Uh, pretty much all, I, I never cook food in here. I only heat water. So there's really not a lot to show other than heating water. Um, if that doesn't answer your question, uh, let me know and I'll, I'll see if I can do better. A little bit different angle, but this is Obsidian Falls. It's probably, I don't know, 40 feet tall. You gotta look at my map, but this may be my water for tonight. I gotta look. It is 7 p.m. And these are the moments I absolutely love. I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you. I'm just sitting here filtering water. I'm at the head of a spring and this spring has a small creek that feeds that waterfall back there. No one is around in this wilderness area. I haven't seen anybody for a little while. 
it is just so calm and peaceful. These are, these are the moments, this is why I do this. The sun getting low behind us. That's the trail. Alright, the spring is coming right out front of that rock. The ground is just full of this black, shiny obsidian. This whole, all, all of it. Looks like black glass everywhere. It doesn't look like the camera's picking up all the glare or the shininess. is 8.20 and I'm sitting in my tent behind me. But look at the sunset, it's incredible. It is 8.45, cooking my dinner. Again, by cooking, all I'm doing is heating water in there. This bag is a mixture of instant mashed potatoes, um, stuffing, and some gravy powder. I'll pour the water in there, and that's um, that and some beef sticks is dinner. And since it's getting dark, this gorgeous sunset over here that you just saw, I'm gonna get uh, my food cooked and eat, and we have like nine miles to town tomorrow morning. So have a good night, everybody, and we'll see you tomorrow.